Let's talk about what's going on in Yemen. The United Nations says it has the worst humanitarian crisis on the planet. And in a world with all sorts of problems, that is saying something. Yemen went from being the heart of ancient Arabia to one of the poorest countries in the Middle East. And for the last five years, it's been torn apart by war. Local groups on the ground are fighting each other, while a Saudi-led coalition bombs from above. It was a campaign of relentless airstrikes. More than 19,000 attacks in the last four years, according to the latest reports. And caught in the fighting are millions of Yemenis desperately struggling to survive. Saudi-led forces say they've been targeting the enemy, but rights groups accuse the coalition of bombing dozens of hospitals and schools, killing thousands of Yemeni civilians. Which brings us to Yemen's immense humanitarian crisis. In this war, it's not just the fighting that's causing all the suffering. Even aid is being used as a weapon. In 2015, the Saudi-led coalition created a land, sea, and air barrier around Yemen, making it almost impossible for supplies to get in or out. The Houthis are also blamed for blocking, destroying, or taking aid. And Yemenis desperately need it. Today's only meal is a plate of plain boiled rice between the family. In a country of 29 million people, the UN says 24 million depend on some kind of humanitarian help. That's nearly the entire population of Australia. More than 11 million children in need of humanitarian aid, nearly every single Yemeni child. This is rapidly becoming the world's worst humanitarian disaster. 